It is the first submarine in history to sink an enemy warship, operating with human horsepower. The H.L. Hunley went down after sinking a Union blockade ship off Charleston, South Carolina in 1864. It was buried in the sand on its side, and it has stayed that way, resting at an angle for more than a decade, even after it was brought to this lab for conservation. Since then, it's become uh, an incredible journey, so to speak. Now, scientists will rotate the 23-ton submarine delicately, exposing sections of the hull not examined in almost 150 years. It is an artifact that still draws wonder. I learned a lot about the men on the ship and how I felt that they felt at the moment that they died. Because they knew when they went on that ship that they were going to die. Hey, put your feet out wide. My feet must have been bad for you. Doing the crank really helped me understand how difficult it was, and I can't even imagine doing that underneath the ocean. Rotating the sub will let scientists finish removing crust from the hull, continuing efforts to save the H.L. Hunley. These are the clues that help us take everything we've got from this historical scene and now try to put a final picture to it. What did happen in the final minutes of the voyage of the H.L. Hunley submarine? A new turn in a search for answers hidden beneath the surface. Lee Powell, The Associated Press.